Welcome to Revival Time Hub, the fire shall ever be burning upon the altar, it shall never go out. The investment of quality time praying in the spirit is a very potent way of activating graces. Investment of quality time praying in the spirit. Not just speaking scripture, it's wonderful, there is a place for that. But quality time praying in tongues, praying in the spirit, you activate graces, you multiply graces. Hmm, this is true, this is true, this is true. It's not about fanatism. There are people who pray amiss, but I am telling you within the boundary of understanding, when you learn to invest quality time praying in the spirit, if you are in this place and you are not filled with the Holy Ghost, with the evidence of praying in tongues, tonight can be a chance for you. The prayer department is there. There are people in their variety who can minister to you. This is not about being a Pentecostal or charismatic. People have abused this tongue thing. It has become so irritating. People do not even want to delve around that area. There is a decent spiritual way of engaging the prayer language of the spirit such that it profits you. Show me a man who knows how to pray in the spirit and is willing to discipline himself. There is no gift of prayer. There is a grace for prayer and supplication. It only empowers you but the energy comes from you. You will pray and pray with energy. You will feel it as you pray but because of the joy that is set before you. You want to heal nations and you just want to stand up, speak one or two scripture, talk for five minutes and stand and tell people to stand up on a wheelchair? No, sir. All things are finished in Christ. But the price for alignment to receive it and make it work in your life, you will need to submit yourself to prayer. Submit yourself to prayer. Submit yourself to prayer. If you are a man of God here, yeah, let me charge you by the message of God. Obtain grace from God. Wake up in the night when others are snoring. For God's sake, for the sake of your destiny, if it is power with God you desire, wake up in the night and pray. Don't pray just to ease guilt. Don't just pray to show people you are prayerful. No. Pray. Something happens to you as you pray. There is an activation that happens as you pray. You see, what you see today is a cumulative of many years of consistency in prayer. It's not two weeks. It's not one year. It's not 10 years. It's not 15 years. It's a cumulative Every time you go to pray, see yourself signing a register in the spirit. Joshua Selman, present your majesty. I'm here. Shamaka Paragata. No one is seeing you. Tomorrow again, Joshua Selman, present, obtaining grace from you as my commitment. I want to be such a host of your grace. Joshua Selman, next week, present, sir. Joshua Selman, present, sir. Come on. Your voice is known in the realm of the spirit. As you shout that present, demons are hearing too. As you are shouting present, principalities are hearing. When you stand before men, you are not pretending. One shout, they know it's a familiar voice. They know the sound of that voice. And they know the power that that voice carries. They know the power. Pray in the spirit in one minute. Prayer. Fellowship with the spirit. Turning you to a sign and a wonder. A man of power in the spirit. A man of power in the spirit. Activating manifold graces. Activating manifold graces. Every grace you carry is prayer dependent for its activation. Every grace you carry, I don't care what dimension of grace. 
it is prayer dependent for its activation the grace for favor prayer dependent the grace for influence prayer dependent signs and wonders prayer dependent wealth and abundance prayer dependent take a minute and pray sign that register in the spirit building yourselves on your most holy faith praying in the Holy Ghost you want God to give you the keys of nations you must submit yourself to prayer my sister submit yourself to prayer my brother submit yourself to prayer man of God this laziness spiritually you won't go far that way takes prayer Someone pray. Someone pray. Someone pray. Someone pray. Alabaka parakata sabrakatesh. Rakata prakate balakate paros. Stewards of the manifold grace. Businessman pray. Businesswoman pray. Pray. Consistently pray, consistently travail, non pretentiously pray. Worshipper pray, apostle pray, prophet pray, banker pray, politician pray, legal practitioner pray, shalakapat. Prayer with fastings. Pray. Prayer with dedications. Holding on to the altar. Generating power. Multiplying grace. Generating power. Apostolic power. Generating power. Multiplying grace. Activating manifold graces. Manifold graces. Manifold graces until you become a sign and a wonder a sign and a wonder until you embody favor until you embody liftings until you embody restoration one more minute you are praying Ela malaga baratos, sabra kata malaga tas, rakata barakata malaga ta, rapata branda barakata braskatesh, labratega barakatos, ebrakato pariata pas. Activate angels in prayer. Activate the hearts of men in prayer. Command possibilities in prayer. Rewrite your destiny in prayer define your possibilities in prayer change narratives in prayer build stamina in prayer sakata balakata rakata prataka parakotos La branta parakata prakatos la grapas katabalaka pariakata tear down the walls of shame and reproach tear down the walls of human biases and limitations tear down the walls of sentiments and prejudices Go ahead and pray. Sadabalaka parukatas, grabada balakatas, skadabalaka parakatos, soda balentas, ibratiga baratos, skadabranta ke parakos, ela baratos ko prende ke ba, so prende parakos, lega pratika pa, egra kata parakatos. So the bellada bakata pranda kaparakatos.
In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. You see, let me tell you the truth. Many people talk about prayer, but I submit to you very few people really understand prayer. Many people, it's a common thing in our world to talk about prayer, especially among ministers of the gospel. Chances are excellent if you don't talk about prayer, you may not be seen as a serious man of God. But very few people really understand the depth, the riches, the dimensions, and the possibilities that befall a man who gives himself to prayer. Non-pretentious, not to have a name, not just to have a good testimony before men. You can rewrite narratives in prayer. You can command possibilities in prayer. You can become a prophet in prayer. It doesn't matter what you had. If you take it to the place of prayer, a full stop becomes a comma. The moment you get to the place of prayer, full stop only remains full stop if you agree. No matter what the issue is, you take every full stop to the place of prayer, you can turn every full stop to a comma and add everything the word of God says should be added. You know the areas where you've not been able to find the kind of results that should support your growth, your advancement. Maybe you are in ministry and the gifts of the spirit are not at work in you. Maybe you are a leader and there's shared disloyalty among the people who work with you because that grace is not there. I want you from the standpoint of this understanding, begin to pray and cry. Cry for the graces that you desire in your life available in God's economy. Pray. Let it be from the depth of your, your heart for some wisdom, for some favor, for some power, miraculous power, for some access to systems and structures, access to governmental authorities. Pray. Ubangi ji ka isayabo na girma ma sunanka ubangi ji are you praying nina ta ka ka sunanka ubangi ji ka isayabo na girma ma sunanka ubangi ji nina ta ka ka sunanka ubangi ji ka isayabo We'll raise your banner high, we'll shine your light so bright. One more time. Nina ta uka ka sunanka, ubangi ji ka isayabo. Na girma ma sunanka, ubangi ji. Father, let me abound in this grace also. I have received the grace for prayer. Let the grace for revelation rest upon me. Let me not just be a prayer person. Access to the mysteries of the kingdom. Someone is praying. The grace for favor. I'm tired of struggling in my organization. Struggling in ministry. Struggling financially. Compromising here and there because of money. Go ahead and pray. Tired of stuntedness. Gifted, but limited. 
because the grace for influence is not there the hear ye him anointing is not there someone pray I make progress but my progress is slow annoyingly slow Lord grant me the grace for speed someone pray pray passionately pray passionately pray passionately the manifold grace of God at work in your life the manifold grace of God financial grace leadership grace grace for prayer grace for revelation grace for influence activating the gifts of man these are the graces that give you an edge in life and destiny these are the graces that give you an edge in ministry an edge in business ten more seconds you are praying ten more seconds you are praying Ten more seconds you are praying. Ten more seconds you are praying. In Jesus' name I pray. In Jesus' name I pray.